Well, well, well. Welcome back to another video here on the channel, guys. My name is Dash. Hope you are having a fantastic day. Thought I'd do a little bit of a different intro, more B00 style, instead of staring at the camera and being like, Hello, guys. Just taking it slow, taking it chill, because this is just a chilled out building series. We're not going to be doing a lot of fighting or building or. or we are going to be doing a lot of building, fighting, or really surviving. Um, and with that in mind, I have played a lot. As you can tell, I have pretty geared up weapons and a full set of diamond armor. And my boots are actually pretty, pretty good. And while enchanting, I found either a new bug uh, or, or a new feature or something that was just kind of maybe left out of the notes or I didn't see. Uh, protection 3 and projectile protection you can now have multiple forms of protection on armor I tried to do the same thing with uh, swords and do like smite and uh, sharpness but it did not work so it is only for armor so I don't still do not know if that is a bug uh, with 1.14 because that is what we are on now or if that is just uh, a little new feature that they've added and if it's a new feature that's really really cool because then you can have protection projectile protection blast protection and fire protection you have all the different types of protection and have some beast mode armor uh we are just gravi uh, gathering up some gravel from that mountain biome right there home is just right over here i did a ton of mining and enchanting in between last episode and this one so that this episode we can really get started working on building and i want to go on ahead and show you guys what i have decided to do for our first project here and on this first episode i want to make quite a bit of uh you know progress with it as well no arrows i want to get infinity uh an infinity book from our fishing but unfortunately i have not been that lucky yet i did uh get enough fishing rods to you know at, combine them in an anvil and get a really nice one and I actually have low levels right now because I was just doing some enchanting and combining uh, to get some good stuff like uh, my pick and shovel and this. They're all pretty bland, but they're all pretty much maxed out for what I want right now. Just efficiency 4 or 5. Um, and I threw out uh, a lot of things. I threw out like all the uh, other like bows and what are they called? Uh, fishing rods that I didn't need and then I forgot about this little block the repair and disenchant block I actually find this in a village but you I'm pretty sure you can craft them as well and what I should have been doing is putting them in here and getting levels for uh, what they had but pretty much all this that you see in front of you is because of this little thing right here this fish farm has been awesome and I got uh, some spare things right here as well a bunch of saddles uh, let's kill this guy really quick and you'll notice I've got jungle wood and cocoa beans over here, and that is, t uh, I'm farming cocoa beans for cocoa powder or like brown dye now to get the brown concrete powder for something we're going to be working on hopefully this episode, and I'll go show you where we're going to be working. Right over here, right behind spawn. Spawn is pretty much right here where we set up base or on a little island that I actually cleared out right here, and I'll explain why later. Uh, and now is this full? Yes, okay. Let's replant and we can put some there as well. Um, kill this guy. Right here, I want to build our a little town area. Just a little town area around this pond. I want to have docks going around the whole thing. A bunch of houses built into these cliffs. I think it's a really nice, pretty area. Uh, not too big uh, either. It's just a nice, small size. If I stand here in the middle, I can just look around and see all of it. Looks really nice and nice and closed. Uh, so I think that's a good project for our first episode here. Uh, so I actually am probably going to kill myself here in the world uh, shortly so I can rem figure out where the exact world spawn is, uh, break my bed and kill myself so that I can uh, build a pathway from spawn over to this first area that we are building. Let's take this guy out really quick. Oh. A little bit of lag right there that is something i've noticed i'm getting like block lag and stuff in single player which is definitely new so uh hopefully that gets fixed with like a 1.14.1 patch or something who knows um but anyways guys i'm going to you know iron some things out uh gather a little bit more materials for what i want to build and then i will be back
All right, so what we need in order to do this is a lot of gravel, a lot of sand, and let's grab us the, where are they at? I swear they're in here, cocoa beans. And can I do this super fast? What is that? That's a barrel? <gasps> That's actually perfect for what I'm doing. Ooh, I want to make some of those. Okay, I, I really should look at stuff like this. And now I don't have, okay uh spruce logs okay more now i can make a barrel now let me see how this looks that is perfect too now is it based on what you build it with okay i just want to try something really quick dark oak get a little bit more And place that. No. Okay, it's not. What can I put in here? Oh, it's just like a chest. Sweet. And I'm assuming I get it with an axe. Sweet. So I guess I, we actually are going to be using those because we are going to be building a little dock, a little fishing town around the pod. And I want the cocoa beans. And let's do this. Why didn't that work? Because I have to change this into brown dye. And now this will work. Yes, sweet. Let's get another stack in there. So this should make four stacks. Oh, I messed it up. Four stacks of brown concrete powder. Yes, we got it. Put that back in there. So let's run over this way. I've cleared out a little bit of area. I'm working on terraforming that to make it all nice and pretty because there was this big cave here. Uh, I died and we spawned pretty much just around this point uh, every single time. So I'm going to make a, a nice little area around here and then the a pathway that leads down this way and into town. And there'll be buildings stretching across. But the main brute of town, it will be right around uh, here. Uh, but the entrance is going to be right here. I might even have like a little gateway, um, which I thought would be cool. But I think I want to extend the dock all the way around the lake, uh, which will be really cool. But it's going to be on this level right here. So let's throw these in. Uh, it's going to use these because that looks real nice next to it. Let's put down a crafting bench real quick. I'm going to make a bunch of spruce wood because we're not going to use any spruce logs. You want a bunch of these trapdoors because they can add. Oh man, got to throw in a piece of cobble real quick. They can add in height variation like that, uh, which is super, super good. We also are going to want a ton of stairs because they can also add a little bit of height variation, a little bit of depth, and of course our brown concrete powder. So we are going to be using these blocks uh primarily uh maybe even throw in uh some slabs here and there but they won't be anywhere near as common as the other blocks uh and i guess we can uh, of course decorate the top with some barrels like this and i could put like uh like stack it up like this this looks really cool just like so so that's like a cool little stack of barrels. I can make a chest as well. Uh, do I have wood? No. So let's make a chest. And throw that right there. So that's a cool little stack of things. So I'm going to work on building these a little bit. And I will show you when I am back. Oh, I actually forgot something. We're actually going to also use coarse dirt in here. So I'm going to have to get more gravel and craft some of that. All right, as you can see, I have done quite a bit of work here. We have worked on uh, this dock, detailing it up, and I have worked on a path going through here. I will, you know, decorate this, and I, I cut out a lot of trees so I could figure out where I wanted it to go, but I will plant them back and decorate it up with some leaves and foliage, and yeah. And normally, I don't like flowers, but this new one, Lily of the Valley, is very, very nice. Uh, I really quite like it. I think it's a nice uh, addition just around here popping around. I think maybe might have a little bit too many. Let's take this one out. 
just put you there for now. Uh, but I want to work on uh, the type of buildings we are going to be doing now. So let's mark this out and go here, here. Now, does that give me enough room to do what I want to do? It does. Okay. So let's go up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight for now. These are going to be tall buildings, but most of the building is actually just a roof. Uh, this is just going to go up by three or up by two from this one and same there and I think we should put that down like that uh, real quick let's do that all right and we can just fill this in with dirt uh, what I want to do not this is put more dark oak here uh, but this it will be different and mix this with the spruce in this building as well so do I have yes that's what I want and we're going to put this here and I can run across one it can go multiple ways I think that's how I'm gonna do this so go there and we can do another one not the spruce one dark oak here very well and I also where's my crafting bench right here let's toss this down Gonna get a little bit of this going, make some stairs. And where does this come in? On the third. So that goes like that. Very well, just like that. And this will go up. Let's get some dirt. Oh, sorry about that. Got a little Discord message if you heard that in the background. Okay, just like that. Now, how does that work? Ooh, I messed up. This comes out. Oh, well, I didn't really mess up. This comes out. Like so. Okay. Let's go up again. Because this does not do that, I believe goes this way bring these up and this comes up like so let's see how this looks let's get this in real quick oh misplaced some blocks everywhere guys and put it like that's not how where it goes goes like that I know there's another one that goes in but yeah that's good for now uh that's good I'm gonna extend that one more up I believe it's I missed a level there real quick let's do that let's go up here just like so and let's see how this looks with that jutting out Looks like a lot, uh, but it won't. This won't look so big and awkward once we get the full building in. This is a small version in here, and then there'll be a larger one, just like that. So I'm gonna work a little bit, uh, finish this up, and then I will be back. All right, guys, I just got done doing a little bit of AFKing here in our new AFK spot. Oop, I actually don't want to go down there, but this is where all the drops go. Got some old stuff thrown out right there. Uh, but if you've been paying attention, you might know where we are. And this should really give you a hint. This is the first new building of the town. Uh, I built another one. This is small. Uh, this one probably isn't even going to house anything important. I might put like a bed in here, something small. This one is not interior design. But this first one, I thought it would be appropriate for our first thing to be a AFK fish farm since, you know, this kind of little fishing village with docks everywhere and uh that fish farm is what has put us in such a good position already in just the second episode of the series so yeah really nice uh area i will put like the good books and stuff i'll store them in here uh and then bad books i'll probably store over here to repair and disenchant them and then along with bows and stuff uh, so yeah got some storage in there uh 
And yeah, it's really, really nice. Got this one as well, and it has a little jut out facing this way. So whenever you're walking into the village, you also get a little, you know, peek into one of the houses. So yeah, I think this is a really, really nice, cool area. Really cool first idea um, for our starting here on the series. I'm not just going to have one base. I'm going to have a bunch of buildings spread out around this with uh, things in it. I will have one main one that we'll probably start working on either next episode or the one after that but more or less we're gonna have most of the stuff spread out you know like i'll have one with the enchant table and one with a furnace array and then the main one will probably have the storage room in it so yeah uh, anyways guys i hope you enjoyed this episode if you really enjoyed it make sure to like uh, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and as always thanks for watching